Okay, I was about to do some work on my property here. Uh, I was about to put a pipe in this ditch for my shooting range. I just build a little land bridge that I'm going to go through the dirt. And then I came up with this good idea. It is called The Thing. Don't do what I did. I put my thirst for revenge in front of my own family. Corn Pop. Such a bad dude. I couldn't stop hunting for him. But here's the, uh, the thing. The thing I've been trying to tell you all this whole time. Mm. The reason why Mitch McConnell froze. I made it to the highest echelons of power. I love my neighbors are always down there just jamming out coolest neighbors ever but it had me thinking like i like to shoot up here and you know they're all cool and stuff but then you're shooting magnums in your backyard i mean it's fucking loud so i'm wondering using this as a world's biggest suppressor it's not really a suppressor it's gonna be a sound mitigation device <laughs> legally it does not obviously it does not attach to any gun this thing it's, you can't believe how heavy this thing is. It's like super hard fiberglass, incredibly hard fiberglass. I don't even know how much one of these things fucking cost nowadays. Got it for free from a job site or something. But I'm surprised the tractor even picked it up. Like, it is incredibly heavy. So, obviously, it's not really a suppressor. It's just a fucking pipe. I'm shooting through a pipe. I was going to put saran wrap on the end. Yeah. Uh, probably down the house i wasn't too fucking worried about all that yeah, but if you put saran wrap on the end and i bet it would be pretty quiet so what we're gonna do you know, test this theory out i got a uh, ruger 1022 and then i got my 308 and i'm gonna use some of these blue rounds and we're gonna see what the sound difference is with the world's biggest suppressor i mean that thing weighs a ton like i if i had to guess at least six, eight hundred pounds. That thing is incredibly heavy. I'd say it's close to six hundred. Like I'm, I'm surprised the tractor picked it up. <laughs> you can tell them them rear tires are pretty light. But uh, yeah, let's try it. Okay, what I'm gonna do? Got you guys set up by a range here. I'm gonna go down there by the tractor. I'll fire off like two shots at a twenty-two, and I'll do two through the pipe there, and see if you can hear the sound difference. And I'll try to get my honest opinion from down there and then I'll do the same with the 308. Okay, did not work at all. Not a look of difference. Probably actually if you did have baffles in there, I thought it would actually work a little bit, but nope. Did not work. I didn't even bother trying a 308 because I was like, dude, 22 is just as loud. So, <laughs> but uh, speaking of that, I'm going to try to get my 308, 308 hater video done tomorrow with the AP rounds, uh, the blue ones, the uh, incendiaries. Uh, Trace, I got all kinds of 308s. I'm actually going to do that tomorrow, God willing, anyway. So, yeah, let's. I'll get that done, so at least that won't hopefully be a fail. Let me go get this pipe off here. Yeah. This thing is a beast, man. Let's see if I can... I can't believe it's not flipping over. <laughs> this track, I love old track, man. It's so good. Let's go put this in a ditch.
One. 